Many designers would protect their design work. Adding watermark would be very important to protect their work. Sometimes they also need to remove the watermarks. Watermarks also help in branding. PDF element is an awesome tool which can do it in just one click. You can add and remove watermarks throughout your documents in just one click. For more information about PDF element, download links and other discount information, check out the video description now. Hey everyone, Creative Venus here and look at this beautiful digital transformation presentation slide design and this is a great concept that I liked and currently it's in it's hot in the market that everyone is talking about digital transformation artificial intelligence so these kind of designs are in demand so I thought it would be a great idea to create such design so I have created this beautiful gradient background and the next step is to start designing the concept so I've inserted this donut shaped uh, circular kind of shape and I've changed its angle and applied this blue color. So now let's insert a circle and we will fit the circle inside this donut shaped circle. So the idea here is to fill this pattern, you know, patterns look good and you should definitely use these patterns. These really help in differentiating different shapes. So I have applied this vibrant blue color and I filled, uh, I have basically fitted it inside this donut shaped circle, the outer circle and let's fill a nice gradient color on this outer circle so in picking up the gradients you have to be a very good selector of colors i mean you should know which color you should i mean use because with a very dark and gradient background your color should come out very nicely and it should be very vibrant and it would be great if you change the material to metallic and also you can play with the lighting angle in the effects option so now I have duplicated this outer circle and applied this white color shape so so it's, it's not a specific kind of shape that I'm looking at so I'm just creating it randomly just thinking what can be done next so you know you have to be very creative here in terms of thinking and visualize what you can draw on your slide so I thought why not start drawing these circles these donut shaped circles one by one and some will be of bigger size and some will be of smaller size and few will be of white color and rest of them will be of gradient color so that's the kind of design i was looking at so now let's duplicate this whole set of circles and place it like this now you can see a beautiful and nice shape is coming out so so this is what you can achieve through powerpoint so Microsoft had, has created this beautiful tool and no one really understands that such things are possible in PowerPoint. If you have to draw such kind of design, the first tool most probably that will come to your mind will be Adobe Photoshop or Illustrator. But as you can see, this is also possible in PowerPoint and it is just by dragging few shapes and changing their colors so it's a very easy tool and one must learn Microsoft PowerPoint because all the deals in the world I mean 90% of them are closed by using PowerPoints only most of the proposals business proposals B2B or B2C are designed or created in PowerPoints 
So PowerPoint is a great seller. And if you're into sales, then you should definitely, you know, learn or, you know, create PowerPoints to pitch for a product or service. So, so here what I'm doing is the one, the thing that I've applied on one shape is replicated on all these circles. So, so by looking at this design you can understand if you can draw this one circle then you can draw this whole shape it's not a rocket science i've placed these circles on the top of each other and these three circles in between are of uh, have different colors so you can try a different approach you can you know keep all the circles in white and three these three circles in gradient so now comes the most important part. So what we will design is a very vibrant colored rays. So some kind of light effect that will pass through the, this shape from top to bottom. So that's what I'm trying to design here. Like we have used this rectangle shape and filled gradient color. And on the right end of the gradient, we have applied this 100% transparency so you can achieve this effect so i've duplicated this rectangle and placed it at the bottom of the shape so you can see our beautiful digital transformation slide uh, design is almost complete now we have to fill some kind of light reflections for that we have inserted these small rectangles this is very easy to create you have to just um, fill some uh, fit some rectangles and you have to randomly place them so like i have placed all these rectangles so let's duplicate this and place next to the first set of rectangles now again duplicate it and you can see these are like small rectangles placed next to each other and what we're gonna do is we're gonna place these rectangles on this light effect and then you'll see that a beautiful kind of effect is coming out a kind of reflection so now i have changed its rotation so that it looks like uh, an isometric design now I have placed it on this light effect. Now our design is almost complete and we will duplicate this two times and we will create three shapes. So here is our final design. Let's have a look. And you can see I have applied this small fade animation and the lights are appearing and coming out very nicely. So I hope you like the design of this slide. So please subscribe us, like this video, hit the bell icon, share this video and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. So see you in my next video. Till then, bye bye, peace, thanks.